Well, hello everybody. Hello Yukon, you chewing up that bone? There he is. Chewing up the bone. Well, on to another project, finally. This is going to be a pool table lamp when it's done. Quite a bit of work still to go here. I'm going to modify these chains. These chains will actually be loops. Go under. I'm not going to drill holes through that and stuff, so it'll be real easy for whoever buys it to rehang it up. This was just like a the rough draft. Put it together. See uh, how you can make it work. That, that, that thing right there is from like about 1910. Uh, pretty cool old thing. Uh, hey, I know. I've been saving that for a lot of years. I know what I can use that for. That actually ties it all in pretty well. I wanted to use some traps right here. If any of you guys out there in YouTube land have a couple of old beaver traps, that's the way I really wanted to attach this. But um put the trap end up here and then the chain's coming down but um yeah hit me up in a private message if you have some old rusty patinaed no good weak spring beaver traps <laughs> and uh hit like and subscribe and you guys will get an update when you see how the stuff's done this one turned out really nice looks really good when the when it's dark outside the shadows that it throws just awesome clear up over the roof and the walls that one turned out really really nice that one right there i've got for uh i'll let that one go for 388 <clears throat> and i gotta make i was gonna make a match to it so there'd be two sides in case somebody wanted to buy the buy the set i'd do the set for probably 700. um then i'd finish these up well, almost finished these up. There's just a very little left to do to them now. Um, I decided to not turn these into lamps, just to leave them as actually accent accent stands for tables. Um, got some. I'm gonna do some do some of these that are custom made for these. So there'll be two with two turkey feathers attached to them with leather and sinew. And I think that's about the only thing I'll do is I'll go around some of the old, some of the junction points to make them look authentic, to make them look like they were from the olden days, go around those junctions with sinew. And uh, a lot of other guys don't do that. But to me, it just makes it look like it came from, from back in the day, how it really would have been if somebody used antlers and put them together. They wouldn't have had a drill and, and screws and all that stuff. So <laughs> that's it's. Just look a little bit better to me that way. But leave your comments, guys. Let me know what you think. You think that's going to be a nice lamp? Let me know. Appreciate you. Bye.